Hello everybody, this is Frog here. We're playing Crash Bandicoot, a number one of the Inside Trilogy. This is part four or whatever. Um, Native Fortress, hint one old school controls. Try the directional buttons. Indeed I will, indeed I will. Um, I am letting you guys know now, I'm, it's been a crazy, a pretty crazy day actually at work these last uh, few days and I was unable to get anything made for you guys. No hidden gems, no uh, no nothing. So what I thought to do instead was do a, an extended let's play of this game for you. It's not much. I know that. I know. I know. But it's, it's something. You know, I want to give you guys a little something because I can't give you anything else at the moment. Uh, hopefully Wednesday we'll have something else up, something, something good. I have a Hidden Gems episode in the works. It's just, I don't have any recordings. I actually don't even have the, uh, the, the, the script written up. So there's there's not much I can do with that right now. So, well anyway, enough banter. I know the what I'm talking about is not necessarily what you care for, which is fine. Um, oh, that was weird. So instead, let's just enjoy some Crash of the Bandicoot. Unfortunately, you just gotta take your time with that. Hopefully, you don't get hit or anything. Woo! Oh yeah, and hold X right there because obviously, as you just saw, there's a there's a box up there, and you can't come back this way after you finish it. You could always die because in the bonus runs, you don't lose any lives. Which is fine. Just pretty cool. I like how they added that little portal thing there. The original, it was just one shot. You know, if you didn't do it, then that sucks. You know, you. It is what it is, and that was actually how they they saved in the original was through that. Yep, there's that Aku Aku there that you saw me grabbed. Grabbed past tense present format. This is a level that you cannot get the gem for. So, don't worry about trying to hit every single box, you know, just try to get, just try to get your lives up, try to get Wampa Fruit. That's pretty much all you can do for this level. Woo. Woo. That was a close one. See that right there? I think it's. Uh, I want to say it's the red gem for this level. And if it's not the red, then it's the yellow. Maybe. Oh, this is cool. Check this out. Life. In case you needed a life. Just get a life, man. That's what people tell me, and then I play Crash. And I'm like, I have 33 of them. That's what happens. His straight skills with a with a Q and a Z squills. <laughs> I could tell you that I did that on purpose. Uh huh. But how many of you would believe me? See. Missing what, 11 boxes, which isn't too too bad, but they're all from uh, the hidden spot, which we'll get to eventually. Ooh, sorry, Crash. It wasn't my fault. I tried. I tried. And that marks the end of the first island. You know, that's as far as you can. That's all you can do. Get all. You know that I just showed you how to get all of the gems, beat all of those levels. 
uh, in your first run of that island. Interesting fact, in the original... Oh, sorry, I know you keep hearing that pop, I apologize. It's my jaw. Ah. Uh, in the original, you actually went left on this island. Instead, in this one, you go right. It's a, that's an odd choice. I don't understand why they, they decided to go that way. Uh, maybe they just weren't paying attention to what they were doing. You know, that is very likely. That could very well have happened. Failing a bonus round doesn't cost lives to retry. We already went through that. All right, up the creek. I'm about to get up. Yeah. No, nah, just kidding. Ooh. I love the music in this level, but can't hear it right now. These things can kill you even when you are the super Aku Aku. So do be careful. Whew, that was a close one. I almost died there. And if you must know, I've been using um, the directional pads pretty much this whole game. It's just a lot easier to use in the first one. Second and third one, yeah, I use the the joystick a lot more, but the directional pad kind of really helped with this. It was this one was a lot more precise jumpingness as compared to uh, the other two. And at the time when this one was first made, there wasn't even a uh, there wasn't even the joystick yet. You hit that, you wait for these to come back. You can see them pop up. Oh shit. Woo. That's a life. You hit this TNT, and then you bounce your way back to love. Because we all love a log. It's log, it's log, it's the biggest, heaviest wood. Shout out to those of you that know what that is. I'm proud of you. Oof. I could have made that. Oh man. Now I gotta wait patiently. Admire the water effects. A lot of people give a bad rep to the water effect in this game. I actually think it's really cool. I love the rippling. I think that that's super, super awesome. Like, this water looks beautiful. Is there something up here? No. Okay, so this one is straightforward. Uh-huh. Uh, oh, ooh. And that is where the magic happens. Bye, Cortex. Bye, bye, Tana. I'll get to you eventually. I'll, I'll get there. R-E-L-A-X, relax. I think this word's by A-Rod Roggers. Football player for those of you that don't know. Yep, first level on Second Island, you can get the gym. What is he, Tomba now? Don't think we're done yet. This is actually uh, going to be the next boss, is popping up here soon. Can you guess who it is? Mm, I can't hear you guys. <laughs> so, I'll tell you, it's Ripper Roo. Uh, he's kind of iffy in this one compared to the other ones. Uh, well, more specifically, the original first one. Because the hitboxes are a little different. So, yeah, let's see. Interesting fact about his level here, there's actually two facts that I could mention. Uh, one, this is the same uh, room as in Crash 2, uh, I think, up. I think what it is upstairs is where you play against him. 
An interesting fact, uh, again, there was actually supposed to be a level specifically designed for your uh, traversing up this waterfall to get to this fight. Uh, unfortunately, Naughty Dog did not have the time to finish that level, but you can still see, uh, if you go online and check it out, you can still see the waterfall level. It had, it had like, um, uh, water mills that you would have to, um, jump around. They were spinning through the water, uh, catapults, all kinds of stuff. And that level was un unfinished. Uh, you can hack the game and b actually be able to play it. Uh, generally, you'll find people playing it from like emulators and stuff. But there was actually supposed to be a level leading up to Ripperoo, not just up the creek. Uh, there's also more evidence of this because up the creek at the very end of that level, you end up seeing this uh, log blocking off the waterfall, which was the beginning to that level. If I'm not mistaken, I might just be blowing smoke up your ass on that part. But everything else I said before that is uh, is true. And if you care enough to look it up, it's actually really interesting. Uh, we're at Lost City now. This level is always a big pain in the tush. Otherwise known as ass. Oh, a lot easier with a mask, I'll tell you that. Ah, uh, and now I can't get mad. There's a thing up there, you, you want to hold X when you're jumping on that box. Because it leads you to Mr. Engrio, which you literally cannot get that without getting that, uh... the exclamation point. It turns on that box. Oh, I haven't shown you what happens if you don't hit an exclamation point. Huh, whatever. Uh, I think there's something up here. Yep, there's an Aku Aku up there. I'm not gonna get him. I'm not, I'm not worried about it. Chances are I'll actually end up dying in this level anyway. Uh, but yeah, the exclamation point. You'll see in uh, later levels that the exclamation point box is actually a... Uh, it's usually a metal box, and it activates the, uh... Oh! <laughs> it activates certain boxes in the level, selected boxes, but you obviously have to get that, otherwise you can't get all those boxes, so you can't get the gem. The reason why I left out of that level is because they kept one feature that was a very prominent feature in the originals in the levels with the colored gems in this one. In the original, if you died at any point in the level, actually, uh, I'll debunk that. You can actually, uh, as long as it, your death is prior to your first checkpoint, you can go back and keep trying it. And I think I can debunk it even further, but I need to check again. But I remember being a kid dying uh, on like the first checkpoint and actually running back through that level that I died in. And I was able to get the, the, uh, the gem at the end. But I'll have to try that again because, you know, I was a kid a long time ago and my memory could deceive me. Anyway, what they did in this one is they actually made it to where in the color gym levels, in the color gym levels, you cannot die. Otherwise, you cannot get the gym. Uh, which is a nice little, like, testament to the difficulty in the original. You know, it, it gives you that challenge again just like that game was. It was just nothing but challenge. Nothing but heartache. Woo! I was end up dying there, so I'm kind of glad I made that. Um, how did I spin that wampa away? Whatever. So, in this one, if you're in a level with a colored gym, you can't die. If you die, you've got to go all the way back. 
And keep in mind, in this version, uh, the embryo, all the bonus stages actually count towards the box count. So like, I can't skip the embryo stage and keep going uh, to get all the boxes because there are boxes in his stage. Now this part, I always get hit. I have realized if you, you know, I'm usually always at the very edge, like on the wall, but here I believe you have to stand like right here. Yeah. Ooh, what am I doing? So you actually can't stand on the edge or against the wall when you're trying to hit that. Otherwise you'll uh, just jump right over it and get hurt and die. If there's a, if you don't have any of the, the guys. Yeah, you can jump and spin him, but if he's on the ground and you try to spin him, it's not gonna work. I think the same thing for the green guys. And I always thought that that was a horrible place to put that. They could have just put it like right here or something. But no, they had to put it all the way over here. Make it super frustrating to try to... Okay. Um, I Alright, not going to complain. Alright, let's see if I can do this. Uh, patience and... Alright, easy. Easy, tranquilo. Oh shit, okay. Uh, 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 uh. And that, and that, and waka waka. I don't know what that was. Wubba lubba -la dub dub. Look at that. These are uh, kind of iffy in this game. As you might have realized, I mentioned that in my stream. Uh, with Pat's the best. Ow, those are kind of a little clunky. I wasn't just talking about uh, in Stormy Ascent, by the way. Oh. There's a way to just like run through this, but I've never been good at this part. I always end up dying. Unless I'm patient like, like what I just was. And that one's pretty easy. Uh, come on, eh? Do your jumpy thing? Yeah. Oof, man. I missed that guy, but it, it's okay. Whew. In the original, if you try to spin him, he knocks you backwards. That's why I, I always, like, my heart skips a beat every time. Every time I, I hit one of those guys. Okay. Let's do this. One, two, three, four, five. That's right, I actually count out loud. Or in my head. Uh, one, two, three, four. Cinco! Haha! <laughs> Which I always thought was interesting. Hi Tana, bye Tana. Man, Cortex needs to stop letting her go, because she seems to escape a lot. You see in the background, you can see uh, the third island. Uh, we'll get there eventually, I promise. Oh jeez! This guy, if you're not careful, he will kill you. So be extra careful against that particular ass wipe. This guy too, uh, he's not as bad, but here, here's a fine example of that exclamation point thing that I was talking about. Huh? Oh man, I thought that I was just gonna fall. Okay. You know, dying only once in that was not that bad. That was actually pretty good. And I guess that's one way you can you can 
put it somewhere. Loading the Wampa Islands. And I'm gonna leave it there. Uh, I am releasing a part two as, as like a, oh man, this level. I am releasing a part two for you, or a second part in this day, of which is a sat -er day, just because I didn't have anything else for you guys. I hope that is good enough. If not, I apologize, but unfortunately it was all I, I was able to do. Anyway, I'm going to let this go so we can start on the next part so I can start getting this, uh, this uploaded as I play it. Alright, see you guys very shortly.